16.5D Rectangle Problems Frames. To help visualize the frame, we need to draw a picture. And we need to keep in mind that the frame is on the left and right, and also the top and bottom of the frame. In example one, we have that a frame measures 13 by 10 inches. So that means we have 13 by 10, and it is of uniform width. The area of the frame is 54. What is the width of the frame? We're looking for the distance here, going all the way around basically. So we're going to have 13 minus 2x and 10 minus 2x because we're taking off and we're looking for the smaller dimension. So we've got that 10 minus 2x, 13 minus 2x equals 54 because this right here is the dimensions for the inside part for our actual actual picture. So if we expand this out we're going to get 130 minus 46x plus 4x squared equal to 54. Let's get the 54 on the other side and put this in order. So we've got 4x squared minus 46x plus 76. All of this is divisible by 2 and it will help us solve this a little bit quicker. So we got 2x squared minus 23x plus 38 equal to 0. This factors easily. So we have 2x minus 19 and x minus 2 equal to 0. So we're going to get that x equals 2 and 19 halves. Now the 19 halves equals about 9.5. Now this is a problem when we go back to our original equation because we had 10 minus 2x and if we take 10 minus 2 times 9.5 we're going to get a negative number so that means this is not a possible solution for us and then our solution is going to be 2 inches. In our second example we have an 8 by 12 inch drawing. So we're going to have 8 inches here, 12 inches here. Again, we have a frame of uniform width around it. And the area of the frame is equal to the area of the picture. Well, the area of the picture is going to be 96. It's the 12 times 8. And the area of the whole thing is going to be 12 plus 2x. Remember, we, remember this distance, these distances are x, and we have 8 plus 2x. So what that means is that the area of the picture, 96, equals 8 plus 2x times 12 plus 2x, and then we want them to be equal. They're not quite equal yet. Um, we know that this area inside the picture frame equals the actual picture, so that means we're going to add 96 to this side also. So we're going to get that this is 
192 equal to 96 plus 40x plus 4x squared. We'll subtract the 192 and put this in order and we're going to get 4x squared plus 40x minus 96. These are all divisible by 4. So we're going to get x squared plus 10x minus 24. This will factor really easy. We'll get x plus 12, x minus 2 equal to 0. So we get that x is equal to a negative 12 and a positive 2. Well, we know we don't have a negative number, so that means that our frame on this one is 2 inches.